The three basic concepts of protocol, again, all based on the hormone FSH, are a protocol called a luteal phase down regulation. This involves two or sometimes three drugs. The major, uh, major drugs in this are uh, luprolide acetate, which is a GnRH agonist. This drug does two things. In this particular protocol, the goal is the second thing that the GnRH agonist does, which is to shut off the risk of ovulation. The second drug in a luteal phase down regulation is an FSH-containing product, and there are several of these on the market. And we all know their names if we're in the middle of fertility therapy, and I don't need to get into that. Some programs will add a third drug, which would contain a combination of both FSH and LH, while other practices tend to use FSH-only protocols. And the data on this is a little bit hard to interpret. Some people strongly advocate for what are called combination protocols that contain both FSH and LH, while others firmly believe that FSH alone is appropriate for treatment. So that's the basic idea of the first protocol.